unanswered questions tonight when it comes to how the city plans to better manage its city manager. ABC 7's Darren Hunt is taking a closer look at Tommy Gonzalez's new statement of goals and expectations. He continues our complete coverage live. Estella, this is the 13-point directive council approved two weeks ago, detailing questions they needed answers to from Gonzalez. And this is the document the city handed out after Tuesday's meeting with many of the same points, but minus uh, several items from the previous list. Now, we were told Mayor Oscar Leeser was not available for comment, but the city's public information officer told us the mayor has spoken to Gonzalez about the missing items in the list, and they will be addressed by the first week in April. City Rep Emma Costa told me today she feels it's time to move forward and, quote, remove the cloud hanging over the city. Here are the four items in that 13-point directive approved by council on February 29th that were not addressed. Number two, which asked the city manager to correct all financial disclosure filings to provide details regarding consulting work. Number six, fully disclose all consulting business and sources of income. Number seven, which is providing tax returns for his consulting business. And number eight, proof of payment for tax services paid to Representative Larry Romero by Gonzalez. That last item is important due to the ethics investigation into Romero, who owns a tax business, and that ethics investigation into Gonzalez. Those required um, more of a, uh, it was more of a legality and so required attorneys to be involved. And at that point, we didn't want attorneys to be involved yesterday. We wanted, we wanted to have the heart-to-heart -heart talk that we've never had with Mr. Gonzalez and tell him these are the goals that we want you, that we are setting for you as a council. Now, Acosta said Gonzalez answered every one of the questions on that 13-point directive except those four they considered legal matters. Regardless, Representative Lily Lamone, who was not at yesterday's meeting, told me she is not happy about how the situation is being handled. Rick and Estelle. Okay, Darren, thank you. For